Hello guys, this is Judy and Paul and today I'm going to do a tutorial on how to make a pocket mine or a Minecraft pocket edition server in the latest version of Minecraft or any version of, of that. Okay, first of all, before we start this video, click the subscribe button and click the like button below, smash it. And if, you, if you're confused about this video, comment down below and I'll answer your comments. Okay guys, here we go. Now, first of all, go to this pocket find GitHub. So this is the link, and go to clone or download. Now download zip. Now it should, if you're using Google Chrome, it should display uh, a download right here. Now open the zip, unzip the file right here, and you'll get this folder. Okay, guys. Once you have downloaded the pocket mine, pocket mine uh, zip now unzip it and and put the file over here and you'll and you'll still receive this pocket mine that far and first when you open the folder you'll not see this uh many fo many files right here first of all you're going to go to the php copy this link over here then download windows and if you're linux or mac os download this um when you download this you'll receive a zip again then unzip the file inside of this folder and you'll receive this bin it means you have installed the php when you have installed the php go go to start server when you follow when you follow the um, the wizard setup you'll receive this many many uh, files right here now when you open this server this says your This thing says your settings of all of your uh, in your server, and now this is the whole server right here. This this folder right here. This is the whole server. So if you run this server and just so when you click on the server right here, your server will only start for your local area. Now then, to make your um, server available for the people worldwide, you have you'll have to go to to uh, part portmap.io you have to set up a account register then after you register you're going to go to configurations then you okay let's delete this configuration so far then we want to create new configuration so we want to create new configuration just put any name here so this doesn't this doesn't uh, say the name of your server just the name of the file itself the portmap file don't change this protocol to you uh, it's the protocol is always UDP uh, okay you can put a comment if you like doesn't really affect the server now generate now once you have generate click download once you have done that it will this it will uh, give you the file OVPN right here once you have done that now install a uh, open VPN from open VPN from openvpn.net now install this if you're Windows then so you will receive this installer now if you have completed all the setups for the installer you'll have this an icon and a GUI open VPN connect on your what do you call this uh, I forgot okay sorry okay so you want to go to import from local server right here I, I mean from local file now if you pick local file it, it will display the files the OVPN files that you download so you you will only receive one now click that now click this any like okay, open it should display uh, now it should display a number right here when you when you hover over that number connect click that connect before you click that connect your your server must be configured on this server file right here so You'll you'll want to you want the server port like this nine one three three. Okay, I forgot. I forgot one thing. Uh, before you after you create the new configuration files, go to mapping rules. Create new rule. Okay, I one short intermission okay once you have creating the map the mapping rules create new rule 
okay this is the name of our configuration the change the protocol to UDP oh uh, now this the host name something just change if you want to change it just change this to ma port map that host or port map that IO okay the port in your PC should be the same as you as you input right here like I input right here port on your PC 9133 so it's the same as our server's port 9133 okay it's not this so this this will you will use this to go into your server you will use this not this this now if you create that all is done so you need to start the server if you start the server connect the open VPN connect that and people will able to access your server now online and yeah that's all if you find this informative guys subscribe and like this video guys and you find this this and you find this uh, tutorial confusing uh, comment down below and I'll help you with this tutorial and I'll see you guys in the next video bye bye guys